recorded live in Austin, Texas, USA. It's the William Montgomery Show, starring William Montgomery, with the Tony Chin Orchestra, the William Montgomery Junior Dancer. As always, William is joined by the lovely Erica. I'm Brett Erickson, and now, here he is, the big red machine, William Montgomery. Yeah, I saw a guy lose like five grand. He, this, it was like 4 a.m. I was about to go to bed. It was like this 25-year-old white guy playing with this like 90-year-old Asian woman. <laughs> playing with that. She kept hitting, and he was down like five grand. He looked so sad. Damn. Yeah, that's the way the numbers roll. That's what happens, and it was, gosh, it was just the anniversary of what's-his-name who shot up the freaking... Country festival? Country festival is just the thing on that. Yeah, I mean, yeah. It was that guy, he was probably a problem gambler. Stephen Paddock was his name, I think. Yeah, Stephen Paddock. Yeah, probably had a damn gambling problem. Yeah, so be careful, but don't gamble. I mean, it can be fun, but... The house always wins. Yeah, the house always wins in gambling. I did acid there one time and had to go back up to the hotel room because it was too many people walking around. <laughs> it was overwhelming. Yeah. I wasn't having fun. It was overwhelming just being there sober. I couldn't imagine. I kept thinking about what it would be like on LSD because there's so much movement and lights and scary. Would you have gener would you have been open for something like that? I don't think so. I would have had to pour some booze on it. I don't think I could do it straight <laughs> straight LSD. I think it'd be too stressful. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Too many people. Yeah, I've been wanting to do it recently, maybe just around one or two other people or something, but I couldn't imagine yeah. doing it around a bunch or at Grant's house. Grant, would you ever do it with us? <laughs> Some LSD? Have you ever before? Uh, how how are you guys with doing that? Like, are you, are you cool what? or would you like yeah, make me chill. like freak out? Chill. Yeah, okay, let's do it. We're good to vibe. Yeah, I mean, have you ever done it before? I have not. Would you ever? Sure. <laughs> maybe we should, we'll maybe we should do it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, maybe we'll do it. Maybe we could do an episode doing it, but that could be weird. I don't know. Okay, we you, we could be the producers. We just put you on the camera. <laughs> no, that's but not going to be good. open for that. <laughs> Two hits of LSD. I just don't think anyone would want to watch that. Oh, Are you yes, popping tops back there? <laughs> no, that was Mike. You heard that? Who? Mike? What's going on? What's he doing? Time like, went he's on. He's two rooms away, popping a, a soda open. <laughs> And now coughing grossly. I'm a um, yes. Yeah. yeah, I mean, please. And there was that scary looking guy in the other room. Casey, did you see the person in the other room? <laughs> yeah, I wasn't sure if you clocked him. Yeah, <laughs> that was pretty spooky. Yeah. What's he talking about, Grant? Uh, that dude booked for tomorrow and then just kind of uh, showed up today. <laughs> Scoping the place out. <laughs> so he was like, I, I want to record some audio. It's like, uh, okay, sure. So I just popped him, put it in the room. Cool. Yeah. He'll add the video later. I guess. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, is that the plan? I hope so. Dub over it. Because I am not recording anything for him. We have a bunch of callers, like a lot. God bless. Okay, should we talk to some people, Casey? Yeah. yeah. yeah we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> Throw them up. Let's take a peek. Yeah, let's see. All right. I'm going to put the first person on. This is Mo. Looked like you were eating a piece of corn. Kind of. <laughs> corn on the cob. I miss corn on the cob. We're rolling a big blaze. Hello? Hello. Oh, wow. Hello. How are you? Uh, my name's Mo. I'm a huge fan, but uh, actually I actually have business to discuss. Uh-oh, uh -oh. interesting. <laughs> okay, we fair go. enough. Grant, okay, yeah, I mean, Grant is the guy to be talking to, so that makes sense, Mo. He's our middleman. Yeah, Grant, for sure. Well, it's it's more personal business. It's more uh, advice Okay, right. let's, I'm out. Then. You guys seem pretty wise. <laughs> Never made it as a wise guy. Never made it as a wise guy. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, my buddy, Frank. He has let's this, see your whole face, he, Mo. Come on. What's going on? Show your jaw. Yeah, Whoa. let's see I don't want to show my uh, pedo stash. You're better looking than I thought you would be. I thought you'd have a really long chin for some reason, but it's actually nice. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, yeah. Mo, my you're looking good, dude. Jealous. We could only see your nose to your eyes earlier. <laughs> Oh, sorry about that. It's really hard to see anything else. <laughs> life, my Nearly whole embarrassing impossible. life. But my buddy Frank, that's who I want to talk about. Let's talk Frank, buddy. Yeah. He's got this big old tumor. 
and he acts like it's on his face and he acts like uh, it's not there at all he acts he, he wants to keep a conversation with me he wants me to pretend like it's not there well tell him to go to a dermatologist he needs to go is it on his skin he needs to go to a dermatologist stat i feel like he's taking care of it but i don't know what to do about talking to him well he, he doesn't talk need to, to talk him. about it all the time maybe once a day you could say hey can we talk about your tumor well, it's like one of those Austin Powers situations where it's like, I, I want to talk to this guy, but I, I just need to bring up the tumor. I just have to talk about it. <laughs> well, bring it up. Yeah, maybe the first time you'll see each other every day, bring it up and say, okay, what steps have you taken since yesterday? <laughs> yeah, I've just steps? been trying to dodge him, honestly, because I just, I'll shout at him every time I see him. I said, tumor. What did you say? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, was there I a robot? No, hold on, I was what was thinking that? about his face. <laughs> I can't control it. <laughs> Well, I don't know. I mean, maybe you stop hanging out with him. Maybe. I mean, he's got to get something done with the tumor. Yeah. I mean, but he's probably going through a lot right now. Mo, let I me know. tell you this, man. That's, let me yeah. tell you this, brother. I bet you think I'm I'm a perfect guy. I would never have a tumor. Look at this. I have a damn cyst right there. I'm just like your friend Frank. Grant, zoom in on the and cyst, And I please. have, yeah. I mean, you've gone to the, di everything's fine with it, though, right? Yeah. Is that but like the queen? Is that the week. queen wart right there? It's a cyst. What do you say? It's a it, cyst. It's a queen cyst. It's a queen cyst. Yeah, not a wart. It's a cyst. <sighs> yeah, if we could take care of it, it would probably make all the other cysts go away. On hey, my Grant, penis. zoom in right here. I have another skin cancer. I'm pretty sure I have to go. I have to go to the dermatologist. At first, I thought you somehow knew I had skin cancer, and I thought it was <laughs> see right there. That's skin cancer. You I barely to, notice it. You barely notice it. That's like an ingrown hair. It yeah. could be, but it has the telltale sides of a <laughs> carcinoma, so we'll see. Well, have you thought about shaving everything, just pure? I have a bet going with my mom. Oh. 20-year bet, so. But it pays out 20 to 1. Pays out 20 to 1, 20 to 1. but it's a 20-year <laughs> bet, so I stand to make a bunch of cash if... We cease yeah. communication. Nice little nest egg. You're going to love it, Mo. Big nest egg. Yeah. I love it. I bet you will. I'll be watching. I bet you will. Yeah, do that. Bring your buddy. And bring your buddy, okay? We're both, we're saying we both have issues on our faces. Bring yeah. your buddy. We can help. Well, I'm reversed. I look goofy as hell. <laughs> what? <laughs> You're reversed. <laughs> Where is his? I'm reversed. <laughs> Where is his sis? That's not what I look like. Where is his uh, giant carcinoma where is it where is it it's like right here it's just like oh, bulging and it's like and the thing is is that i i work i trade stocks with him you know we we put all our stocks in into ethereum coin and yeah. chilies yeah keep it liquid you are you're gonna want to cash out on that chilies we will that's the thing is i'm trying to but he's the guy i gotta talk to and then every time i see him i'm Stopper. Stopper. <laughs> who's that back awesome. there <laughs> is that your this is my neighbor's dog I try to close the window and everything. Well, is his name Boomer? Um, I think his name is J.P. Boomer. J.P. Boomer. J.P. Boomer. We used to know J.P. Boomer. We did. Yeah. Wait, we, really? Yeah, we were traveling. We were in a band. Mm -hmm. We played a lot in Wisconsin. Yeah. The Mangrove Maybe Brothers. Maybe she named her dog after your band. Yeah, Mangrove Brothers. That yeah. was such a crazy yeah. time. It's sort of industrial noise beats like suicide violence. Sex punk, a Dude, decent amount of sex punk. Not a sex punk. Uh, but Industrial yeah, was, sex punk band. Yeah, sex punk. It was... Uh, yeah, Grant, thanks a lot. That was too close. That's all I was... You were trying to talk to Mo. I was trying to, is that better? Do you want it much smaller? Oh, no, I think that's perfect. No, that's perfect. I think it looks pretty good. Well, Mo, I'm I think you talk to your friend. I think you'll bury the hatchet, man. Tell them how you're feeling. Yeah. Once a day. Yeah. Once in the morning. Wake up. Wake one up. Go to the gym. Well, mm -hmm. I was just wondering if it was like a personal problem with me, or is it this guy's problem for not being able to talk about it? Sounds like his problem. It's a his problem thing for it's his sure. Problem, right? Yeah, I was yeah. just going to leave it for him to deal with. You sound like a good friend. I mean, you're keeping tabs on him. You're willing to talk every day about chili stocks, Ethereum. Yeah, you have his dog. I mean, where is this guy? We're starting to... It, are you with this guy right now? Uh, I, can, I can't disclose that. All right, he... 
I can't disclose that. You I don't know how to answer this background. question. Yeah, we hear him. Well, Mo, yeah, it's I'm been great road. talking to you, my friend. Yes. Bury the hatchet. Have fun with your friend, man. You don't know Thank how long anybody's going to be here. No problem. Good to talk to you, Mo. Yeah, you don't know how much longer he's got, man. We have no, yeah, we, it could be terminal. Life's not it guaranteed. It could be anything, but I mean, yeah, he's just got to figure that out, I guess. Yeah, you'll help him. I'll help him. Pray for him. Or I'll ignore it. Or ignore it. Or ignore it. That's fine, too. Or just fucking delete his number out of your phone, block his shit, fucking move on. Move but I'll on. But also stalk him like usual. I like to keep tabs on him. I like to wait outside of his garage. Usually, maybe hide in the bushes. Use the Apple thing. Time. Use the Apple mm-hmm. tracker. That's a good tracking yeah. device. You oh, could probably use that. Yeah. Life 360, too. You can put yeah. Life 360 on his Life phone. Life 360. Well, I was thinking about <laughs> inventing a thing where I could like throw an Apple tag and stick it like a Batman tracking device. Wait, throw what is Life 360? Guys. You can just see what somebody else is doing on their phone? <laughs> yeah, it's for like if you have a son <laughs> who's like 10 years old, you can see where he is all the time on his smartphone. Cool. So treat him like your son, brother. Yeah, man. I'll treat him like my Godspeed, son. Godspeed, dude. Godspeed. <laughs> Stay true. Yeah. Gosh, I don't even. That was too. That was a lot. Yeah, that put basically all my training to the test. That really did. I feel like you 100%, you <laughs> dealt with it good because I was, <laughs> when he started talking about his, fr- I, I was shocked. I was shocked. I almost checked the fuck out. I go, I'm not even qualified to talk about that. Yeah. Well, it worked out. All right, Grant. <laughs> I want to see a picture. I wish he had a picture of his friend's big misshapen face. I know. I've pulled the next person in. I'm just waiting for them to start their stuff. So your cyst is getting bigger. It's getting bigger. I think it's hit maximum size capacity that my skin will allow it, but it's got to be removed pretty soon. Yeah, go to a dermatologist. Yeah. Yeah, I went to the ER last time. They didn't really do anything. They just lanced it and gave me a bunch of tramadol, which made me very irritable. (laughs) (laughs) Hello. Allison, hello. We can't hear you. (laughs) Allison. (laughs) Allison. Allison Lopez. We got you, Allison. We know your last name. Yeah, sorry. You doxed yourself. (laughs) (laughs) We cannot hear you. Allison, speak up. Can you hear me? Now we can. Oh, my gosh. Hi. Allison, hello. <laughs> Hold on. You're going out again. Oh are you playing a prank? Or are are you? you? Am I pumped? No. Is Ashton here? You're I pumped. just went to a wedding this weekend. <laughs> yeah, check your closet. I requested all weekend I requested. Never mind. I don't know. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> weekend everyone hated it <laughs> that's always good it for really the, didn't go over well for the father-daughter dance that's a good song when he's letting <laughs> he's giving his daughter away yeah that's a good one father, a good of father of the bride father of the bride danny devito yeah the oh penguin. my god you guys the penguin. <laughs> father of the bride danny devito is the pink one where are you in a castle you are walking where are yeah. you walking i live on the third floor so be careful up there. Is it hot up there today? <laughs> what is it hot up there today? It's real hot. I had to turn down the AC just now. Where are I you? did. Where are you? Uh, New uh, Mexico. I live in the greatest city in the world. We're going to guess. Yeah. Guess. New city in the world. Van Nuys. Albuquerque. Plus. Um, Plus. Riverside County. Mm. Los Feliz. Oh Columbus, my gosh. Columbus, Ohio. Columbus, Ohio. <laughs> and I saw William, uh, I think, three weeks ago now. Yeah, that was kind of, it felt like a disaster for me a little bit, but it was. Oh my uh, God, it was great. What, but, but yeah, it was. <laughs> um, I was DMing someone else at the show and trying to get you to smoke a J with me. He didn't, he didn't end up wanting to meet up, but Ooh, I said, I uh, I'm not going to say who. I'm not going to name yeah, names. Yeah, don't name names, please. Please, please, never, we but... don't need that heat. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know, I just wanted you to know that the offer was outstanding and uh, he just cool. didn't let you know. OK, well, good to know. Now I'm going to track. Now I'm going to figure out who the fuck it is. Yeah, he's yeah. going to retrace yeah, yeah, yeah. his steps. You yeah, get gonna, to the bottom of it. Yeah. Well, how's your day? Your day's going good. My day's going good. Um, I just followed Erica on Instagram because she became public recently. Yes. 
So that's Ooh. the news in my life. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah, it was a big <laughs> fight we got uh, and I was like you have to do it on public. It was it got Oh into this. no, I bet. Shoot, I should have brought it up because I felt like that was a conversation based on her going public. I was like you're in the public eye. Oh, it was a Everyone's long conversation, which we don't need yeah. to get into right now. But, okay, okay, okay. But I'm, sorry. I'm sorry I brought it up in the yeah. first place. That was on me. That was on me. Yeah, I mean, it was um, a long conversation. I didn't follow anyone new on Instagram recently. I didn't know Erica had an Instagram. Well, yeah. I don't, well, well, congratulations on all of your success, you guys. Thank you. Look at you two. We're just hanging out in here today. It's getting much <laughs> nicer in Austin, much nicer temperatures, a lot oh, cooler. Mm -hmm. Highly recommend Saw 10. Saw 10, it's off the charts. The best since Saw 2. Yes. Okay. Okay, that's good to know. I haven't seen Saw 2 or 3. Do you want three. to play a game? Or what does he say? <laughs> <laughs> what does the guy say? <laughs> Would you like to play a game? Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's so that scary. I know. John yeah. Kramer is his name, the jigsaw killer. Yeah, his email. Okay. It gives out his email in the movie. It's like John Whoa. Kramer556 at gmail.com. <laughs> but apparently <laughs> Gmail wasn't around back then, so they should have figured that one out yeah. before they did that. Should have been Hotmail. Yeah. Hotmail, AOL. What was your first uh, AOL account? It was talking247 at <laughs> AOL.com. <laughs> Were you like a chat service? What was uh, uh, No, no, no. <laughs> I was just, a, I just like to chat. I just like to talk, so it was talking 24-7. I think I got in trouble with my teachers for talking too much, so I decided that would be my, just it was either it my internet. AOL or my AIM. What What if John Kramer's email, you like see it for a second, and it's like softball lover 86. <laughs> so, so like, <laughs> hot topic freak 81. Yeah. Uh, what? Taekwondo he's creating girl. his horrible yeah. things. Yeah, karate girl 85. <laughs> <laughs> I love yeah. that. I like that little background. That's gamey and fun. Guys, yeah, Casey was gambling this past weekend. I was in oh. Las Vegas, La Viglin. Las oh, Vegas, La Viglin. It was very <laughs> fun. Las Vegas, La Viglin. Uh, was it? Did you? I feel like that's tricky as a non uh, drinker, unless you're yes. drinking. I don't know. That's your business. But. No, I didn't hit the bottle. I thought about it. I lost. I lost, and then won. A hundred dollars on roulette four separate times. Lost it, won it, oh. lost it, won it, lost it, won it. Then I okay, called so it quits. Okay, so where did you end up? Dead even. You, then I went home. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's pretty good. Not bad. Good job. Thank you. Nice good outcome. Work out in Vegas. Yeah. <laughs> good outcome. Look at you. <laughs> Thank you. Happy Allison. for you. I'm happy. Yeah, for you. I need to come to Austin <laughs> soon. <and> visit. <laughs> <Me too. laughs> <laughs> well, it's a nice time down here. All right, Allison. Well, so nice. To, what are you eating for dinner tonight? Do you have any plans? Uh, I was going to get sushi for oh. dinner, honestly, but I have to see what Tiny wants for dinner. She'll probably want Wendy's. Are you in the same apartment as that last guy? That last guy had a dog barking as well. <laughs> Are you with uh, Mo from the the first guy? His friend has a No, I'm cyst. not, but you should set us up because Tiny loves friends. Mm. Tiny. Tiny. Yeah, yeah. well, yeah, I, we'll cute. set y'all up with Mo. <laughs> okay, that'd be great. I like Tiny. Yeah, you would think Tiny looking at Mo, he has a long chin, but he doesn't. He looks normal. Okay, yeah, it's a little dog, little baby. It's a little He's friend. A little baby. All right, Allison. Uh -huh. Bye. We okay, bye guys. Bye. Good to talk to you, old hey. friend. <laughs> Goodbye, <laughs> bye, Tiny. How do I hang up? <laughs> <laughs> Grant has to hang up. She's stuck in limbo. Grant, come on. She's got to go, Grant. Sorry, she's gone. Tiny needs Wendy's. Yeah, Tiny was hungry. Tiny looked hungry. Yeah, like emaciated. Looked, looked like it was working. hungry. It looked like it smelled hungry. <laughs> I wonder what smelling hungry is like. <laughs> Damn, that dog smelled hungry. Yeah. That's the last time you feed that thing. <laughs> <laughs> dog smells starving right now. It's like a very sweet scent. Yeah. Uh, I'm bringing in the next Yo. guest. Whoa. And reveal yourself. There we go. Gorgeous. Grant. What's up, Grant? everybody? Grant, what's up? Where are you in the barracks right now? Looks like you're an Air Force pilot. I'm at my office. I'm a propane salesman. Oh, nice. Close enough. Yeah, close enough. Pretty much. Close enough, basically, right? <laughs> Jets go off of propane a bunch of the time. 
Most jets, propane canister. Bada Have you ever bada. thought about that? Go to your local uh, airport, see if you can sell some to them. We sell to Spirit Airlines, actually. So nice. Well, y'all have there are other airlines y'all can talk to. Talk to uh, okay. Southwest. Okay. Talk to Northwest, Southwest. Talk to. I'd move yeah. up the ladder. Spirit's a little bit of a stink. Stink. Yeah, pot. that's right. That's true. Yeah, y'all can get up to United. You can get up to American. You could Emirates. Yes, Air Paris. Yeah. Air yeah, Ireland. Ireland. <laughs> well, Grant, so have, <laughs> how's your how's your week been going? Have you sold some propane? I mean, how are we looking yeah. this week? Cool. So propane's looking pretty good this week. Um, nice. We're about at you know dollar fifty is our cost. I'm selling it for dollar seventy five, cutting great deals. Girl gas propane, you know. Um, yeah. What do you say to end the deal to to really to really bring it on home that you're you're going to be their salesman? What do you how do you end it? So on my email quotes, I'm always like, air free and on time delivery from Feral Gas. <laughs> Ready to sign up, you know. So I got a little bit of a pitch. Yeah. I love that. <laughs> yeah, you would have to have some sort of a, you would have to have some sort of angle. Something for sure. For sure. Are you a big King of the Hill fan? Doesn't he sell propane? Oh, yeah. Propane? Hank, he does Hank propane Hill. and propane accessories. And my Instagram bio, it says young Hank Hill. So <laughs> love it. <laughs> Makes sense in the same industry. <laughs> mm -hmm. Have you always, it sounds like you've always wanted to sell propane. Is this true or am I totally out of line? No. So I grew up watching King of the Hill. I graduated from the University of Missouri uh, two years ago. Go Bulls. <laughs> no, I'm what? kidding. I'm kidding. Okay. Okay. Come on now. The Tigers. 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 Mizzou. We're kidding. Yeah, yeah, Mizzou. That's right. Ow. So I graduated. I found Feral Gas at a virtual career fair. They sent me through a management program. I got sent out to Nevada City, California mm -hmm. uh, for four months. Then I lived in Memphis for a year. You meet any uh, cartels in California? No, it was northern part of California, so it was pretty conservative, pretty safe. Humble County. Yes, sir. That's it right grow. there in the background. Nice, nice. Is that you? Yeah, that's me. Actually, that was twenty years ago. Let me yeah. get out of your way. Sorry about that. Oh my gosh, there you that are. was twenty years ago. You look great, man. Thanks, man. Yeah, it's I figured out the septum. <laughs> what? How? How old are you? Twenty. I'm twenty five. Yeah. Okay, that math kind of adds yeah. up. I'm trying to figure this yeah, out. You were a big yeah. baby, man. Yeah, you were a big little kid. <laughs> got that Ben Button, you know. Got that Ben Button disease. <laughs> baby, get that Ben Button. <laughs> <laughs> but then it's a baby guys. leaning over. <laughs> or somebody <laughs> leaning over. Not a baby, but. <laughs> cool. Yeah, big team. Both your guys have been watching Kill Tony and stuff. So uh, just wanted to stop in. I honestly had no idea how this was going to work. I just saw Will's Instagram post. And I'm like, yeah, I'll, I'll try. I'm like, why is it this thing started yet? I didn't know it was like. <laughs> well, that's on Grant. I mean, we're yeah. already. Grant we has already. He tripped both of us when we walked in earlier. There's another guy in here who he's scamming. I mean, his oh. the, the whole stuff with Papa John Schnatter, and <laughs> I mean, that's still a sore subject, kind of when he went over to his house. But oh, nice. Yeah, uh, Papa John Hunting Schnatter. In the just a, dude, that's me. That's right. That is uh, exactly you. It's Papa funny. John uh, basically just beat the brakes off his ass. It's we'll yeah. give you the cliff notes. He came in, beat the brakes off his ass. He said, his... "You want to play a game?" <laughs> <laughs> Sounds right. It does sound right. And so, pray for him. As a Grant, how do you feel about that? My name? Yeah. I was supposed to be Chandler. Um, I actually don't mind the name Grant. I, I sometimes part of the sales pitch will say, "You know, Grant Smith, great salesman." Was talking to a Gavin Summers in the alliteration. It just sometimes it plays, man. It what do people laugh or people just remember your name for you doing that? So the one time I, I've only done it once. I'll be honest. But the one yeah, time cool. I did yeah, do it, still in the beta phase. Yeah, it's the GS initials, so it all worked out at one time. But um, yeah, well, one I don't for think one. Again. It's one for one, hundred percent. That's right. That's a hundred percent. That's good. Keep it, keep growing it. Keep doing it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Keep them on their toes. Keep yeah. selling the gas, brother. Yes, sir. I give appreciate them hell out there. Come on. Give them hell out there. You got to give them Don't hell. Don't take no for an answer. Right. Mm -mm. Always be closing. That's right. ABC. ABC, always be closing. Coffee's for closers. <laughs> ABC, right. Thanks, one, two, three. We love you, guys. Bye, see you. See you, guys. Hook his damn eyes out. Whoa, it went into the... <sighs> it went oh, into God. the mirror thing. <laughs> to the solvers. 
Damn, I can't wait to see the Saw Extended Universe. So you saw Saw 10? Yeah. Was it good? It was good. Apparently, it's between two and three. Oh, that's so where it I takes wish place. I had seen the set because I think I've yeah. seen a lot of them, but I haven't seen them in years. And I think it's set between two and three. Oh, okay. Yeah, I have the 10. Walmart always has great movie collections on DVD. I have saw one through eight on DVD, five bucks. Pretty good deal. Damn. Damn. So we could get together, watch one through five. We should. Yeah, we totally need to watch at least two and three. Yeah, that's fun. I'm excited. I like John Kramer. Yeah, it was cool. He's in there. And he doesn't yeah. look any older, really, but apparently the girl, there's some girl who helps him in the, in the first one. Mm -hmm. She looks, Erica thought she looked a little older. Oh, yeah. I remember her. Carson. Carson. We can't hear we you. We can't hear you. I don't Fuck know. Knuckles. <laughs> Fuck Knuckles. <laughs> Carson. There it is, buddy. Whoa. We're back. <laughs> How you doing, fellas? Good evening. Good. How are y'all? Where are y'all right now? You're good. I'm in Temecula, <laughs> California, my man. Hey, you did a cameo for me last week, William. I'm going to be on house arrest after my friends Wendy and uh, <laughs> Kenny got me tickets. I mean, I can't make it to the show on the 28th when you're in San Diego. Well, that's right. bullshit. Why Bull would you tell shit. me that right now? <laughs> We've been having fun in here today. We've been having a great day. We Honestly. met a grant. Is really hey, no, for ass. sure. Just, just a swell feller. You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, we you talked to Grant. Fun. We talked to Mo. Mo, we could only see some of his face part of the time. But his friend had a tumor. We met Allison too. She has a little dog that eats Wendy's. Yeah, Allison's yeah. dog loves Wendy's. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, so where are you at work? At, and we told I'm Grant there's only one fucking person supposed to be on this thing. So, Grant, this is a fucking problem right you now. You fucked up. You fucked up. No, I'm kidding. Right. Where are you <laughs> at your sorry, place? Guys. Are you at your place of work or you're, you're just hanging yeah, out I'm over at, there? I'm at Old Town Barbers down here. I'm a barber. So. What could you do with yeah. my hair right now because i'm what, it's what a could disaster. i do with your hair right now uh i mean i'm not a magician william so could you I give don't... me like a high top Ooh. fade or something i could give you a low side fade i think that'd be looking i need a high too. top yeah. fade carson i can give you a damn knuckle sandwich the way you're talking, yeah what do you carson? mean you're a, not a magician yeah. what is that I'm, not a magician. Mean? I'm about to start cracking schools um, but Jess. Hey, hey, keep cracking them, dude. I'm going to be right here in Old Town Barbers, Winchester. All right? <laughs> yeah, Casey's just getting my back. Okay, you could maybe do a high top fade. I don't know. It would maybe take time. There's something you could probably do, right? I mean, yeah, there's something I could do. I mean, I, I can get my glasses out. Maybe I can cut the top of your hair. You know what I mean? I got to see what's up there, little fella. You know? uh, yeah, okay. Well, fair enough. It would take fair a little enough. magic, you, but maybe. What are you drinking on over there? <laughs> I have, or? this is a, I started drinking again last night. This is a uh, You're seltzer. You're a piece of shit. Yeah, you it was almost two and a half years. I back. just, I'm back on the wagon. Back on the wagon, dude. I can't be more proud of you. In case he's drinking water, huh? Yeah, I'm still on the wagon, but I'm praying for William a speedy recovery. Yeah, I'm like yeah, fucked no, up. Sure. I didn't even go to sleep last night. <laughs> no, you got a little wild? Yeah. Yeah. And he's on benzos. Yep, I'm on he's pills. On <laughs> <laughs> it's not right. funny. No, it's hilarious. Erica's pissed. Yeah, I mean, I'm on benzos. That's why Erica's not here. It's bad. It's all right. I've been going That's to fine, Supercuts. Dude. I've been bothering all the motherfuckers over at Supercuts because they tell me the same shit. Like, what do you mean on high top well, fade? <laughs> yeah, and they're like, mm. what's your hair well, looking like? That's a little mine? misleading. You're wearing a hat, hat being a barber. Yeah. Yeah, I know. All right, well, it actually looks really good. So, yeah, that's actually. I actually, appreciate it. What's that called? Thank you. <laughs> so this is called the high top boogie that William can't get, dude. Oh no! Well, maybe in another world, <laughs> another lifetime. Maybe brother. another lifetime it'll happen. Maybe another, yeah, no doubt, no it, doubt. It could. It there, could happen. You just gotta try to believe that it can. You know, it can happen. Just but try I don't to know, believe but. it could happen, and then it might happen, <laughs> and we'll see. Holy is, shit! Is that the fire? There was a bad fire over in y'all's county, I think, the other week. Is this a picture from yeah, the fire? Did you start that? Did you start that fire? We did. That fire start was right fire. between Carson's mom's <laughs> leg, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> Who is that? We didn't do it shit, is, Carson. This, this is some little son of a bitch that works with me right here. Evening touch. His name's Chris the barber, yeah. but he's not really a barber. 
Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, you're going to be, man. Just stick with it. Keep on cutting people's hair. Keep on using the barbicide on the brushes. You're going to make That's it. That's right. You know it. Just make sure Carson <laughs> is nice to you. It seems like I'm getting a I'm a, getting a vibe that Carson might be a big hazer for the people trying to work their I way up know. in the game. Carson, you need I, to be nice. I think I'm pretty fair to everyone. I think I'm pretty fair to the shop. This is, this is the shop right here, though. Seem like a ball buster. You know? You're in there, boss. Oh, yeah. oh, that's a huge that's a piece of property. That dude doesn't want to be on camera. Yes, he does. <laughs> that dude yes, doesn't does. want to fucking be Carson. Come on. He had to blur his face. He wants to a be on camera. Legal nightmare. There he is. The yeah. guy, they don't oh, need to be messing with this shit. They need to be focusing on the guy's hair. We don't. Come nope. on, man. <laughs> come on, dude. We're going to be tied up in hey, small next claims. Next time court. you're in town, you need to come down to Old Town Barbers and get a haircut from your boy. Could you All at right. least do a little thing in my eyebrow? I can I can do a little thing in yeah. the eyebrows. <laughs> I want that. If that's what gets you in here. All right. That would help me get in my zone. Yeah. yeah. Is that what you were about to say? What were you about to say? Get in my what? I don't know. Finish it. Finish it. <laughs> Finish it. <laughs> Finish no, it. I will give Grant's you a high top board. fade if you come in here. Okay. Thank you. I want to get yeah, no. Kyrie Irving shaved in the side of my head. You got it. Hell yeah. We got you. Yeah. Love basketball. Maybe. <laughs> All right. Can you do that? Can you shave like people, like people's faces and stuff on somebody's head? Are you that good? Yeah. 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 We're, 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 we, you know, maybe not me, but someone else down here can do that. Nice. Carson's we, not the head dog. That needs to happen. Okay. But well, there's somebody else. Barber. Yeah. All right, Carson. Well, nice to talk to you. Have a hell of a day today. <laughs> All right, I appreciate you guys. I'll see you guys. <laughs> Put an Irving up there. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys later. Hey, Thank you, bye. guys. All right. That was dope. See, I can put him on the side of your head for you. Thank you. Hold on, leave it right there. Right there? <laughs> right where it needs to be. <laughs> Pretty cool. He was very charismatic. Yeah, he was. He was funny. Saying it would take a magician to fucking, it's like, what the fuck? Yeah, that no, kind of pisses probably me right, off. though. No, he's not. Don't listen to okay, Carson. Okay, okay. I know. He's Don't. not right. Barbers are ball busters, man. 100%. I mean, he was a perfect example of just how out of control they can get in the right environment. <laughs> yeah, you get them together, it's just an echo chamber. Yep. Inside of that barber shop, it's, yeah, and he can't do the the faces on people's heads, but the other guy gets, like, who's the other yeah, guy then? Yeah. Let's Put see him the, the other camera. guy. He's so damn talented. Yeah, I don't get it. I'm starting to think he's just a damn intern. He's just talking big. Yeah, there's no way he was probably... Yeah, there's no way. He was a barber. No. Not with that fade he had. Yeah, he had the hat on. I mean, you can't be wearing a hat mm -hmm. as a barber. I don't think that's a good look. What a joke. Grant, do you agree? Or what do you think? Totally. Should you wear a hat if you're a barber? No. You gotta show off the goods. That's how you get people in the door. That's Where do right. you get your hair cut, Grant? I cut my own hair. Hmm. Really? That's why it looks so good. He was a barber the whole time. Yeah. It was always you, Grant. <laughs> it's always been you. Aw, oh, thanks, guys. <laughs> uh, Keegan is not uh, joining, so I'm in a... Keegan Michael Key. How about... Keegan Gis Michael Keys. Let's, uh, let's bring guy. Giuseppe in. Giuseppe. Ooh. Do we know Giuseppe? Is this Giuseppe from Austin? Do you know a Giuseppe? I know one Giuseppe. Is this Giuseppe? F I don't know. We know one. Well, let's see if... Giuseppe starts their video. Giuseppe, we're waiting. Giuseppe, we're on a very tight time frame. Hey. This is not up? my Giuseppe. <laughs> <laughs> not your Giuseppe. Giuseppe, how are you? Great, how are you, man? Good. Good. You got a setup behind you. What are those lights going on? Are you at a nightclub or is that your house? <laughs> uh, no, this is my studio. Hell yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, cool. Let's see some of the vinyls. Hey. What do you got? Yeah, what you got over there? Hold on. It's all flipped. <laughs> nice. Cool. Do you have do you keep the records inside of those or do you have the records somewhere else or are they just uh, no. locked what up? What I in did there? in order Yeah, no, what I did in order to make them fit, I just uh printed them. Oh, Interesting. Art.com? <laughs> no. <Art>. Oh. Okay. <laughs> It's like Walgreens. Yeah, Walgreens.com. <laughs> I think they can do that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's where I get my goods. 
Uh, Giuseppe, I was going to try to, sometimes we can guess where people are. Uh, I don't see any windows behind you, so this is going to be hard. Are you, uh, mm. Pittsburgh? I thought you would recognize me. Kansas City? Giuseppe, stop. What do you mean you thought? Hold on, you stop. You yelled at me for like 20 minutes Saturday. <laughs> this you past Saturday? You yelled at my wife. <laughs> yeah, but you didn't know that I'm Italian. And you uh, were yelling uh, at my wife. Uh, oh, oh my gosh, Giuseppe! Hold on, you were on the front where you buy the guy oh. who something happened to his heart. <laughs> yeah. I remember yeah. seeing that guy out there. Oh my gosh, that was your wife, kind of front and center. Yeah, <laughs> Giuseppe, I want to formally apologize again. We having a lot of fun in here today. I really don't yeah. want to bring down the vibe. We're both getting sick, so Giuseppe, <laughs> I just want to For tell what? you, I huh? We think it's RSV. What do you do? Yeah. Uh, no, I want to apologize. I should not have yelled at your wife. That was a horrible <laughs> no. mistake. I thought it was going to be funny in the moment. I could tell. I thought you were maybe laughing. She was kind of laughing, but not really laughing. <laughs> so it no, was, was, it was a really hard choice. No, it, was, it was hilarious. It was okay. hilarious. You know why? Because she didn't know you before. I never showed her any of your videos because I think that was the funniest part of the show that you know, and then you and started then she yelling. Was and she was the one who wasn't laughing. Do. I mean, she wasn't laughing at any of the <laughs> shit. <laughs> so I just, <laughs> because she because because she was embarrassed because she didn't know how close we were to the stage when I got the tickets. Yeah, y'all were front and center. I remember. Yeah, that. and it's <laughs> funny. <laughs> from from the from the like di the diagram of the theater is actually like five feet back. Interesting. And he said I was like, you know what happened? Like when David Lucas came out. A zipper was open, and I, I had this crotch on my face, and it all open. I'm like, dude, <laughs> close that shit. Could you see his? <laughs> could you see his penis in there? No, I saw it's like underwear. I'm like, close oh, it up, man. <laughs> Yeah, we do this thing before we go on stage where we both say, "Okay, I'm gonna unzip it. I'm gonna zip it back up." And this kind of like a game. Sometimes it's fun. We think it's funny if we forget to zip it back yeah. up. It's like some challenge we do. It's a backstage but challenge. But you did awesome, man. That was that was brilliant. <laughs> it, it was really awesome. Well, thank you. Is your wife there? I would uh, maybe I should apologize <laughs> to her. <laughs> no, she's not here right now. What did y'all split up or something? No, I just picked up the kids from school. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. Cool. Well, Giuseppe, I yeah, I want to apply. I can't believe it's you. Yeah, it's sitting up. up no, front. man, it was hilarious. It was hilarious. It, it was really like I think that um, the crowd was really cold. It, this area is very difficult. Um, okay, well, don't because... remind me. What are you even? Why are you even bringing this up, Giuseppe? No, because you tell me up. about no, you it. Really... <laughs> no, you did awesome. That's what I'm telling you. You got everybody to like getting you engage with everybody, and everybody laughed. But it's a really cold crowd, so you, that's what I'm trying to tell you. It, and you know, <laughs> well, I was trying. I had a IBS issue the week before <laughs> David did. He had to duty real bad. Uh, <laughs> Well, so please tell your wife I'm sorry, and we highly recommend y'all need to go see Saw 10. Have you ever seen any of those where the guy kills the people weird? With the traps. <laughs> With the traps. What is that? Saw. Jigsaw. Jigsaw. What's the guy's name again? John Kramer. John Kramer. 556 at gmail.com. If you want to email him, that's his email, and somebody responds. Let me play a game. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's that guy. You want to play a game? You want to play a damn game? Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> oh my gosh we'll watch it it's very it's uh, it's something else it's far out yeah it's something else be careful watching it but we are officially in the halloween season so it could be a fun thing for you and your wife to do but so X. but you know did you see the little girl that was kidnapped and that was found yesterday yeah, were you going to say that I look like the guy? Because don't say that. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I wasn't about to. That's what some, just, somebody was saying earlier, that I look like the dude. Yeah. <laughs> Grant, can you pull a picture up of the guy that kidnapped the person? It wasn't Kramer. <laughs> no, not Kramer. John Kramer? John Kramer. Him, but also somebody kidnapped some girl in, in New York. New York oh, State. Oh, the girl that was found, found in the cupboard? Yeah, in the cupboard of the RV. Indian in the cupboard. So what about the guy, oh, Giuseppe? Why'd you yeah. bring him up? <laughs> no, when I said my thought about you, not because you look like him. 
Because yeah. William kidnaps? <laughs> what? Because, yeah, because I fucking kidnap <laughs> people. <laughs> no, man, because you really guys look like twins. <laughs> he did. He brought it back I don't, on you. Yeah. Why did you? We just <laughs> fell for your trap. I I promised myself I wouldn't fall for any fucking no, traps I, I today. How, how, did you like Did you like the area when you came Saturday? Huh? <laughs> did you like the Did you like the crowd Saturday? Did you like the area? Yeah, it seemed fun. It was just a very brief uh, brief time there, but yeah, it was fun. Oh, yeah, I don't shit. look anything like this guy. The guy has blue eyes. I have brown That's eyes. Like you when you were disappointed. I have brown I eyes. Know. He has blue eyes. Yeah, I don't see the resemblance. No? <laughs> Actually, I wish my hair looked more like his. I think his is a cool length. <laughs> yeah, I think so, his so is then, a fun length. I mean, yeah, this is my new identity now. I'm. Well, um, <laughs> so now, now that you put it up, this guy, no, it doesn't look like you. It looks like the guy that sings that vital song from Richmond. Oh, Anthony Oliver. Anthony Oliver. He's actually <laughs> a friend of ours. He yeah, he's really a really like close him. friend now, so we can't discuss that. If, if he okay. or if he does not look like this guy, we <laughs> not discussing that. Yeah, sorry. Problem for another day. Bro. Yeah, sorry, Giuseppe, but no way can we talk about not that touching. right now. Not touching. <laughs> yeah. Not no way, no how. Yeah, not with the ten foot pole, not with anything. We're not <laughs> touching. Slipper is a sink. Yeah, stinky as a banana peel. Not touching with a ten foot pole. Yeah, like a sink with some dog shampoo in it. Uh, Dude, come on, look at that. See, I'm in the middle. It should be. You well, it's kind of weird. No, you look like you could fit in as well. You actually kind of look like uh, us three. It's weird, Giuseppe. Did you realize that? See, the prank has turned on to you. Yeah. You actually kind of look like. <laughs> These three Dude, people, so kind of weird, huh? It's kind of like we're in the twilight zone right now. How's that feel? <laughs> Twist yeah, it Yeah, look, up. see, yeah. Do your mouth kind of like, yeah, kind of open a little bit. Fisherman's not. Uh, no, your mouth open like support. just a little, kind of. Yep, see? <sighs> yeah. Looks pretty similar. I couldn't tell which one was a video, which one was a picture. Yeah, it was hard to see. All right, Giuseppe, well, very nice to talk to you. Uh... <laughs> And tell your wife I meant every fucking word I said. <laughs> All right. See ya. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Goodbye. We love you. What Giuseppe. do you do? <laughs> just <laughs> stay, stay put. <laughs> yeah, just <laughs> hold on tight. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, yeah, you wish. <laughs> He's okay, Giuseppe. <laughs> Grant, you got to get him off. He's still creaming us from a distance. I yeah, didn't know he was still there. <laughs> oh <laughs> my god! He got in the you wish. He got he got in the last word, and I hate when some bastard gets in the last. Yeah, word. Grant, <laughs> get him off, fat. You got to get on your shit when that happens. <laughs> what, yeah, what did he say? You wish. He said you wish. Oh you wish. gosh, you wish what? That he looks super handsome, like that guy in that picture. Yeah. The game of Thrones guy, yeah. You win. Yeah, I remember yelling at his fucking wife. <laughs> <laughs> She's sitting right there. Yeah, I'm still doing it. Yeah. Normally, you yell at someone's wife, you walk off stage, you wipe your hands of it. It really came back to haunt you. Yes, I know. Damn. Yeah, that was strange. <laughs> <laughs> Too funny. Hello? That's hilarious. Oh, Giuseppe. Ocean. Dude. William. What's up? Hello, Ocean. Not too much. How about you, man? Nothing. We're just chilling. We just, uh, some guy pretty much pranked us on the last uh, last call. It was something else. We've been having fun, even though I got a kind of TT. I'm holding it in. <laughs> man, I held it in a lot last night. Do you ever do that? I, I hold it in sometimes when I need to. Good man. Yeah, you got to be careful, though, because you can get a uh, bladder infection. Not good. UTI, not good. Better nope. to piss, brother. I thought you were British when you first got on the phone. Are you not British? I am not British. We trust Yeah, you. I heard some accent yeah. for a second, I thought. Is that a prank? No, sorry to disappoint. A Halloween prank. No, we're, you didn't disappoint. Oh, shit, come on. We're happy to see you. <laughs> <laughs> well, how's your day been going? What are you doing? Not much, not much. Did some laundry. That's always out. good. Did you fold the clothes? You have to fold the laundry. I'm pretty bad about getting mm -hmm. a good load in, drying it, and then sometimes I leave it in the dryer, and then it starts stinking. Yeah. 
I'm not going to lie. I folded the towels. I didn't fold my clothes. Got to get on the shirts, brother. They're going to get wrinkled as a, a bitch in a knapsack. Yeah. Ho hopefully yeah. you laid them out nicely, though. Did you? Or are they crumpled right now? They're crumpled. They're oh, crumpled. you have to at least yeah. lay them out nice, Ocean, next time. You have to <laughs> at least. Because then you can get away with doing that. But you have to lay them out really nice after you get them out immediately. Nice and flat. Next time. Yeah, and then you don't have to worry if it's there for a couple of weeks because they're in they're in a good spot. Safe place. So, Ocean, what are you going to be for Halloween this year? Do you have any plans yet? Uh, I don't know. Well, I haven't really right. uh, given it much thought. Could be a lizard, could be a frog. Ooh, amphibians. Nice. Why, why off the fun. top of your little dome, why are you thinking some sort of lizard, stinky frog? What makes you say that? Just, you know could be a stinky frog it could be fun i can't argue with that yeah i mean it totally could be in there you could make a frog costume you could probably get one at a spirit halloween or you could totally uh you could make one mm -hmm. get some green clothes get a sweatshirt sweatpants uh you can get those googly eye things you put on your head so it looks like you're a lizard with the big eyes coming out That'd be funny as hell. You gotta add a, a tail somehow. I don't know if that's with towels or, but something. Maybe get a scientist beaker and be like, uh, something didn't go right. Yeah. <laughs> <That'd be laughs> like funny. the chemical that's accidentally yeah. fell on you. Yeah. Oh, that's it, yeah. Ocean. That's funny. That could be fun. Oh my gosh, oh. and look at what Grant has done. Grant, come on, dude. Grant, You're loco. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> yeah, Grant's been acting loco ever since this stuff with uh, Papa John Schnatter getting his family. But that was like oh, a month Papa ago. Sh they got Grant's family. Yeah, he beat the brakes off his wife. <laughs> yeah, it was. it's going to be a lawsuit in a couple of years. That's he what Grant's telling Grant. us. Not good. Hobbled what are him. you guys going to be for Halloween? Ooh, God, I don't even know. I've been so stressed out. Yeah, I don't know. I've been really stressed too, but I think it may be Doug with the Limu Emu. What is that? It's like a nationwide insurance. It's some insurance. I'm thinking maybe Doug, or I'm thinking maybe some insurance person. Maybe the uh, the other like guy. Flow. That could be fun. Maybe. Yeah. Uh, what is that? Franklin Mutual. Yeah, Franklin Mutual has a fun <laughs> one. What Roger? I think is his name. He seems quirky. Yeah. Are you uh are you familiar with the general? The general. And save some time. Oh, that would be cool. Could... Yeah, the general could work. Um there's all kinds of options, but luckily we're just at the very beginning of October. Um yeah. Well, if you're the general, I could uh, I could be the Geico Gecko. Nice. That would be perfect. That'd be funny. General Geico Gecko uh the moon. Yeah, so it could be the moon. That's an easy <laughs> costume to make. You just get poster board and cut out a couple big circles and wear black sweatpants and sweatshirts. <laughs> <laughs> you always have yeah. to have your body the color of generally what you're trying to do. Yeah, if you're going to hide in the woods, have your body be some sort of covered in leaves. In mm. Ocean, I have to say, you've taken more steps than anybody who's ever called in before. What are you looking uh, for? I can't lie. When I'm on the phone sometimes, I, I like to pace around, you know? Yeah, no, I hear yeah. you. When I used to do a bunch the of habit. cocaine, I would totally yeah. <laughs> be yeah, walking not, around. Walking around. <laughs> yeah, but, uh, but yeah. You want to see my cat? Yes, please. Yeah, let's see your cat. What's your cat's name? His name's Bubbles. 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 Give us a head nod, Bubs. Thank Bubbles. you. Bubbles. Bubbles. Thank you, pal. Bubbles. Is Bubbles pretty sweet? He's pretty sweet. I can't lie. Pretty round bastard. Yeah, what well, do you give him fancy boy. feast? Of a um I do give him fancy feast. You were spot on. Nice. Ooh. Oh my gosh, fancy feast. I actually saw <laughs> some hilarious video right before he got here of somebody from one of those stupid ass shows like 90 Day Fiance. And the guy, it's some clip of the guy giving her crackers, and he said it's tuna fish, and she eats it, and then she freaks out because it's cat food. <laughs> the They're on a date? <laughs> yeah. yeah, it was something on the show. It was a date at her fucking house. I don't know. Uh, very weird. Ocean, do you have a fiance? I don't have a fiance. I have a girlfriend. Close. Yeah, it could be close. close. Are y'all thinking about how long have y'all been together? Uh, 
long time, like five years. Oh, you got to pop the question, Ocean. Yeah. <laughs> is she going to... I'm only 21, high school, high school sweetheart. I don't know. Ocean's lost in the woods. <laughs> yeah, Ocean, what... Oh, no. Grant, what happened? Did Grant oh, lose God, me? We're gone, too. <laughs> yeah, hold on. Now everything was You're black. Back. Well, who knows? She might say yes to <laughs> the dress. Excellent. She might not. Maybe you won't ask her. Maybe it's not. You'll figure it out. You're 21. You have a lot of time to figure this out, Ocean. Thank you, William. I needed to hear that. You got a lot of time, yeah. brother. You're good. Yeah, just take it easy. Just don't kill her or something. If y'all get into a fight, <laughs> just whatever you do, don't kill her because that will change your life. Just break up, okay? Yeah. Don't don't chop her up. Don't even do anything get, like that. Even if you get manslaughter, you're looking at being in the pen till at least 30. Yeah, and that's going to be a nightmare. So That would be a big-time nightmare. Yeah. Pretty yeah, thing would, like you. It would be an actual nightmare. Gosh, when I was, <laughs> when we were flying back, I had a vivid dream that the plane was doing these slow, almost crashes. And then I wake up and the plane is actually going through a little bit of turbulence. And I was scared <laughs> to death. I was like, wait, was this just a dream or actually? Uh, it was like it a was final so destination. Bad. Ooh. Uh, but whatever. All right, Ocean. Well, very nice to talk to you. Eat something good tonight. Thank you, William. It was great to talk to you. You as well, Casey. Oh, good to talk to you, Ocean. See you, man. Figure See, out something for Halloween. Guy. For you and your I'll girlfriend, you can do a couple's thing. Yeah. Very true. Lawrence Taylor. Have a good one, guys. See ya. Yeah, Bye. Lawrence Taylor, and then what's uh, the other girl, the girl from The Matrix? <laughs> <laughs> Lawrence, wait, what? You're thinking of Lawrence Fishburne. Yeah, Lawrence Fishburne. <laughs> Lawrence Taylor's a football player. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That would be a great pairing. Be Florence Taylor, the football player, and then uh, yeah, whatever that woman's name is in the making. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that would be funny getting those things confused, but people <laughs> wouldn't really know what it was. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, well, Ocean took the most steps. I think <laughs> definitely he's definitely at the leaderboard with the step was. Yes, nice cat, super nice. You guys ready for the next one? Yeah. <laughs> We're going to try Keegan again because he changed his name too. I'm sorry I didn't turn my camera on soon enough. <laughs> well, we'll give him one more shot. Better be good. I'm in here blowing clouds. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How's that thing? It's fine. It makes me feel kind of weird. Doesn't? Yeah. The nicotine amount is strange. Keegan. Keegan. We're watching you. Oh, and Keegan's making, he's walking too a little bit. Yeah. Paceman. You gotta turn your audio on, Keegan. We can't hear you, Keegler. Keegler. Can you hear me now? Yep. Keegan's. Yeah, Keegan. Dude, oh. I'm such a big fan of both of you. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, you're so nice to call in. Oh, it's it's uh, daytime where you are. Or no, is it? Oh, I thought that was uh, <laughs> sunlight. Kitty. There's some sunlight. Is it sunlight, Keegan? No, no, no. It's, it's this uh, light. A light, light. Whoa, look at that. What is? What was that light? You could use that for a Halloween costume somehow. Yeah. I could. Little I could. Bray. What should I go as this year? <sighs> I mean, the insurance people are going to be assumed to instant classic. Yeah. It could be Harley Quinn. Yeah. I would love that. <laughs> Harley Quinn could be fun. Um, Mr. J. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> <laughs> was she talking about the Joker when she says that? Yeah, Mr. Yeah. J. It's an affectionate nickname. So, Keegan, no, you I've, get a I've uh, been watching you, William, for probably like two and a half years. I'm a huge fan. And um, I just figured out about Casey as well. And you're you're so funny. Oh, thank you. Well, you're very thank sweet, you, Keegan. Uh, Colin. I'm just, why don't you have your fan going right now? Turn the fan on. You know what? I'm turning the fan on. Yes. Thank you. Thank Keegan, you. where are you? And this bitch can spin. Woo. Woo. You're not kidding. That went right away. Oh, no. It's about to get going. You haven't seen nothing yet. It's going to be like a <laughs> helicopter thing where it looks like it's not moving. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's on fucking turbo mode. Dude, by the way, William, uh, I'm sorry. The Nagano Olympics in 2002, I gave you that pipe bomb. I did not make sure it was well equipped. It was going to work. I promise you. You've well, never talked to that's, what again, you, that's what you said. It was going to work. It didn't work. I was in Nagano. I, you weren't in Nagano. Yeah. You yeah. were in the States. Yeah, no, yeah. yeah, of course I was in Nagano. I was in Nagano. I, you 
Yeah. You uh, piece of shit. You piece of shit. You were the one in the States, dude. <laughs> I was in fucking Japan. You didn't hold up your end of the deal. I didn't hold up my end of the deal. I told him, I said, look, this is high-grade explosives. It's going to work. You're going to hit the African man in mid-stride. <laughs> and what do I know? I pull the bomb out. I create it. I do some fucking little tinkering with the bomb, okay? Synthesis. It didn't work out. And ever since then, you've been leaving me on red. You haven't been the same. Well, that's what happens. I spent, and it didn't have to be an African guy. I heard you mention <laughs> African guy. You specifically asked, and look, this is you. You said, I want the Kenyan No, I didn't, runner. and we're not I talking want... about the Nagano. Look, somebody else is blowing clouds. <laughs> that makes two of us, Keegan. <laughs> be careful with that. I actually, my Zen pouches, I didn't put my first two in until like uh, 1.30 today. I have to slow down. Keegan, you don't do the Zen pouches, do you? I don't. I don't. A lot of buddies do them. Uh, I'm addicted careful. to the Chinese chemicals. Nice. Yeah, that looks cool. very toxic, but kind of cool uh, looking. I mean, it, it kind of had demonic. a clear top to it. It did. It Corn. did. Some <laughs> child in their in mid, mid labor decided to go with this right here. Yeah, the per, the high up person of the company is a kid who is have is having a kid in mid labor. <laughs> They're like, we have to have the designs. <laughs> <laughs> finalized before you have this kid because it's yeah i mean it happens well keegan you had you <laughs> it was shocking William, William, you brought that uh, up you might remember this i i'm the one who dm'd you the picture of simon cow and i said dracula and simon cow are brothers <laughs> <laughs> I, that how was could you, you forget? how could you forget that was, that was me okay yeah. well i didn't know i didn't realize it was you now i realize it keegan i didn't realize it first i wish you had said that at the very beginning because this conversation would have gone a lot differently i didn't it would have no. gone a lot differently look I, I dm you uh every time i get drunk if i get like irreparably <laughs> drunk i dm you and i'm like you're the greatest comedic mind to ever face the earth. You're just like some. You're well, the I like where your ever. heart's at. I like where your heart's at. But yeah, you you have to be careful. That's exactly. That's what I would do. I would get wasted and I would DM John Stamos yeah. and <laughs> message Wendy John Williams. Stamos. Yeah, <laughs> Wendy Williams, John Stamos, uh, the dude who's the dad in Beethoven, the dog movie. <laughs> Oh, fuck. Charles amazing. Yeah, John Ritter. Uh, I have a, um, you know what? I'm going to come to you guys about some advice. So I feel like oh. you are, are you socially anxious generally? Who is that question for, Keegan? Which one? Both? You, William. Are, are, are you, uh, I feel like that on stage, sometimes I see you kind of, uh, kind of shell up sometimes when people don't laugh. Like, do you struggle with social anxiety at all, just in general? Uh, I'm not as sociable as I once was. I still totally enjoy interacting with people, but I I don't Me go too. out to like big parties or anything like that. I would much rather be just hanging out. But at one point in time in my life, I mean, I'm 36. At one point in time in my life, I love doing that, but I don't know. It's fine. And I'm totally fine. Now thinking about it, it exhausts me, kind of. But I've turned into a real lazy piece of shit, like so... I deal, I deal with, um, I randomly all of a sudden started like feeling anxious around people. And I've always been like a social butterfly. I've always talked to a lot of people and, uh, I feel like I use alcohol as a crutch to make me feel less, uh, self-aware and to kind of like override that. And, and it was that why, cause I remember you went through addiction and was that that's something that you use as a crutch or can you relate me that, that sentiment in any way? How, how old are you Keegan? Uh, I'm 22. I'm really young. Yeah, no, I mean, I would totally, yeah, I used to love Keegan. Never do cocaine, okay? Because that was a real social lubricant. <laughs> but now there's uh, fentanyl and everything, so that seems scary. But yeah, I don't know. I mean, I generally, I enjoy interacting with people, but I like my alone time and not, I don't know, so. Around that age, around 22, I started to get more <clears throat> socially anxious as well. I think your body changes a little bit. Maybe normal so. yeah man it just happens baby just don't yeah don't start blacking out and driving your car you could get in trouble <laughs> right right or also like, your uh, limbs can start going numb like my, huh 
I'm sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt, but uh, I think that's one reason why I look up to both of you is because to get on a stage and to be your authentic self and to and to kind of like um, uh, just give people 100 percent of you is so difficult. And I look up to you guys in in such a big way because of that. And William, like uh, your stand up, for example, I've watched every set from the first one to your most recent. I, I tune into every Kill Tony just to see you. And cool. um, I think it's cool. so amazing the way that you people don't understand what you're doing. And I feel like that you're telling this one uh, cohesive story from beginning to end and you do it in the most beautiful way. And you're a genius. And uh, well, I just you're I don't very think sweet. I wish, that. Keegan, you're very sweet, though. I pre I totally appreciate it. I'm glad I'm glad somebody sees the storyline. OK, I've been going for a storyline <laughs> since the beginning. So I'm glad somebody <laughs> sees it, Keegan. <laughs> Right, right. Because there's there's like consistent characters and then you do callbacks from sets that were 40 sets ago. And it's like, like it's so <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't mean I've and just run out of stuff to say. <laughs> <laughs> but no, yeah, I get no, it, I for get sure, it. And, for um, sure. Yeah, yeah. And, and it, with Casey as well, like, dude, the way you've turned like that autistic like mean community into a stand-up and it's fucking brilliant and oh, thank you um, I, I, you guys are just geniuses way ahead of your time and it's it's so cool to watch and i and it's an honor to even be on the podcast truly <laughs> well you're thank very you, sweet Jacob. to call in man thanks a lot yeah. and yeah you'll be good maybe don't drink as much yeah. i don't know i mean there are times where i kind of miss it but i just it makes me anxious even thinking about it because i'd get all way too fucked up For so sure. it's totally fine right. not doing it it's totally fine yeah anything you right, do right. drunk you can easily do sober and i think if you're in a social situation you can also seek people out who are also feeling a little awkward because most people feel a little awkward too so you can find them yeah, I think yeah. so. I think it just uh, comes down to realizing that everybody feels that way mm -hmm. and that you can't put people on a pedestal. And I, I don't Definitely. know why I've always had trouble with that. But um, but uh, yeah, you guys comedy is an escape. I mean, uh, I quote every day of the week. I never made it as a ways, man. <laughs> I, I, all day I do that shit. And then uh, and then when people Thank at you. work, I'll, uh, I do the Nagano Olympics in 2002. All that I, I, I quote you guys every I day. You guys are fucking that, hilarious. That I don't know that. That's bit, so yeah. funny. You said that. You said that. In I a remember. <laughs> I've forgotten, though. There's all kinds of stuff. Keegan, for the longest time, I'd be all fucked up doing it, though. So there's all kinds know, of bullshit. I, I probably yeah. don't even remember it all. I probably should go back and just watch some stuff, but I just don't. Yeah. But. You should, because uh, did Tony tell you to start being a bit more joke oriented, like back to back? Because you used to be the stream of consciousness. No, like you would it's just, just kind of, kinda, like, I don't know. It's just kind of changed. Evolves. I don't yeah. know. I, I do love uh, your new sets, but I do love the old sets when I could tell you were like panicking a little bit. You were like, <laughs> fuck it. Um, I have a grandma who. Uh, I, know. I, I, I know. I know. <laughs> It's a work in progress, Keegan. It's a work in progress, <laughs> but you've been phenomenal. You've been phenomenal. Um, well, thanks, who, Keegan. We need more callers key? like you. I know. I'm totally oh, well, kidding. Thank you so much. But you're thank very you. sweet. Uh, who's the uh, European guy, the new guy? Have you gotten a chance to talk with him? The guy from Brussels? Yeah. Uh, uh, Rick. Uh, yeah, Rick. Rick, funny. Rick, Rick Diaz. Is, is his name Rick? Oh, yeah, Rick Diaz. Rick Diaz. Yeah. yeah. He's great. Yeah, he's very funny. Yeah, he's pretty cool. Uh, so, so is he going to, do you think he's going to do more sets? Or like he's going to be a regular? I don't maybe? know. He's back uh, in Europe, I think. Already? Yeah, he's he's yeah. back, I think. He comes and, comes and goes. He's been around a little bit in Austin. Yeah, he's like a something with body, ha harvesting stuff with bodies or something. And he doesn't yeah. like using the word harvesting, but yeah. it's something with bodies. It's a hostile he, thing. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of, it's like a salt and hostile. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't like it when people say harvesting, but it's essentially like a harvesting kind of, it's a harvesting thing. Yeah, he calls it remediating, which yes. I don't really understand. But. Yeah, harvesting sounds more like it, <laughs> what it actually is, but... <laughs> Yeah, that's what he does. I think he's been doing it for a while. Good money. But yeah, man, look, when it, yeah, William, I mean, I'm sorry about the pipe bomb. Uh, I swear <laughs> to God, I swear to God, next time it's going to go properly. I, I can assure you. Thank you, Keegan. All right, Keegan, very nice to we talk trust to you. you. We trust you. We trust you, brother. Yes. All right. Hey, thank you. It's been a pleasure. I love both of you guys. I hope you guys are in a good mental space. Uh, genuinely a pleasure. <laughs> thank Working you so on much. It. All right, Keegan. Thank you, Keegan. Thank you, man. All right. Good to talk to you, dude. 
Very nice. Very sweet. That was nice. He's funny. I know. He'll get it. He'll figure it out. He's getting it. Yeah, he's getting yeah, it. At twenty two, you just start getting you start getting more anxious as you get in your twenties, especially when you're boozing. Make you get anxious when you're not boozing. For sure. Get scared. For sure. Starting out the cocaine, I was yeah. probably yeah Either around you that age. S- stick with it and double down. Yeah. Or you got to quit it completely. You can't dabble. You, you got to either can't dabble. Go fully, a hundred miles an hour. <laughs> but you might you hit a brick go. wall. You might hit going a hundred miles an hour. Yeah. If you if you ride like lightning, you're gonna crash like thunder. Yep. Uh, <laughs> okay. What is that? Are we kind of are we done, Grant? I don't even know when we started. Uh, we're over an hour in. Do you want another one? Do one. We yeah, we one. can do another one. You want to do one more little little wrap up? <laughs> yeah. One more rascal. One more rascal. Uh, yeah, I waited till one thirty to put the things in. I have to like with this. I just have to. St- <laughs> the Zins? Oh, yeah, it's not good. <laughs> yeah, I smoked so many cigarettes in Las Vegas. I smoke like two packs a day. I feel so bad. Yeah, you can feel it in your lungs. Mm-hmm. I smoked some this past weekend, and I could just feel it. Uh, I could feel it. Yeah. Yo. Whoa. Hello. Oh, somebody's there. Diego. Hey, what's up, guys? Hi. Mr. Flores, how are you doing? Hey, doing very good. Greetings from Mexico. Oh, nice. Hello. Diego, what's the temperature down there? Where are you in Mexico? Uh, it's a place called Aguascalientes. It's a... Uh, hot water? Hot water? <laughs> hot water? Hot water, yeah. Wow. It's literally hot water. <laughs> what, do you all have springs there? Is there actual hot water or it just gets real hot there so the wa- a lot of the water's hot? Oh, no. It's just, uh, it's just a hot-ass place. Really? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> makes sense. <laughs> are How hard are we talking? Oh, oh shit! It's uh, like uh, forty degrees Celsius outside. I don't know. I don't know how to convert to Fahrenheit. One fifty. Yeah, that's like one fifty <laughs> Fahrenheit. So that's insane. <laughs> it's fucked up. It's fucked up. My God. It's even more than me that I'm a big guy. So, you, yeah. how much you weigh in these days, Diego? How tall are you? <laughs> Oh shit! I'm uh, six five. Damn, uh, that's really big. Six five, three twenty, something like that. You're Damn, you're mountain. bluffing. We got a big no, boy no, on no. our hands. <laughs> did you play any <laughs> athletics growing up? There isn't a lot of football. Where did you grow up? Or there's the other kind of football. Oh no, I played American football. Like, oh cool. Uh, collegiate level here in Mexico, it's like. Uh, it's like Division Two, there, cool. the highest level. Oh. I had no football idea league. Mexico had college football. That's just, crazy. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah, so yeah. cool. Our, our name uh, was the Vaqueros, which means the Cowboys. So oh, that's fucking cool. Sucked, dude. We fucking sucked. What, <laughs> was the mascot fun? What was the mascot like? A star like the Dallas Cowboys or like a cowboy? Not at all. It was like a, like a, just a, like a bandit. A type of guy. <laughs> cool. Oh, yeah, I see. And, nice. Like Zorro yeah, kind of. We, we lost uh, 81 0 ones. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> That's a high scoring uh, college football game. <laughs> uh, not from our end, but yeah, we got uh, fucking <laughs> destroyed. <laughs> it's like a touchdown every single yeah. possession. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they, they had the fucking water boys, uh, you know, uh, playing. They didn't know how to stop scoring. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm sure it was fun. I'm sure you made some friends playing. Yeah, yeah. It was it was it was great. I cool. also started uh a stand up here in Mexico, which oh. is very new as well. Nice. Where do y'all do stand up? In like a bar or a little what is the kind of place? Just two donkeys and cactus over there. No, no. I'm not nice. fucking around. <laughs> I'm fucking around. No, yeah, like bars, but people don't know a lot about stand up, so it's uh how do I get this camera in my face? Holy shit. Uh Center. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what do you, you do it in okay? Spanish or English? I do it in Spanish. There's like uh there's a few open mics in English in Mexico City. Oh damn! Could we? Could Casey and I come visit yeah. you? Would it, would we be all right down there? Me having what? us looking how we do, we'd be fine down in Mexico City, right? Yeah, dude. I want to see you screaming at some fucking 
<laughs> I'd have to be careful. Yeah. Though. I'd probably have to be careful. What if it was somebody in like a cartel or something? Usually it's done in like the best part of the city. Like, uh, <laughs> like uh, Mexico City has like a very gentrified center. Oh, and okay, okay. Yeah, there, there's not a, like a lot, of, a lot of that stuff. Where I live is kind of fucked up, but uh, in Mexico City, it's not that bad. Cool. And also, you're huge, so you could protect yeah. us, maybe. Yeah, I will be. I will be your bodyguard. No, 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 no. Nobody's touching you, my friend. Cool. <laughs> Do you have any kind of pistols or weapons or anything? Oh yeah, I have a fucking truck full of uh, rocket launchers. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah! I, I Aguas Calientes. Uh, uh, William, I wanted to tell you, like, you're from my favorite comic, dude. Like, I, I oh, well, that, thank the, you, Diego. Uh, the the fucking era where the COVID was locked down and you told uh, Red Band you weren't going to kill him in a scuba diving accident. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, was, <laughs> that was fucking insane. Dude. Oh, gosh. Yeah, those <laughs> were kind of uh, crazy times, Diego. It was weird. There was nobody. <laughs> there wasn't any audience at the comedy store. So it was just us and the people. It wasn't anybody in there. So it was very strange times. <laughs> It was real it, weird. Uh, but yeah, it was fun. That was a fun time. Well, you guys were living in a bubble together like the NBA finals, right? They had you guys in the same hotel room. Yes. Yeah, yeah. the Kill Tony people. Yeah. So tensions were high. Yeah, I, re I remember those episodes were like a adult swim fucking fever dream, some, something like that. I don't know. It was incredible, dude. I, I, I loved it. I climbed uh, the tree. The remember I climbed a tree one time? <laughs> <laughs> that was at the apartment where I lived. There was a wonderful patio thing. It was like a shitty room I lived in, but it had a wonderful patio. And I just go start drinking up there after work and just get lit up <laughs> and then call in via Zoom or whatever the fuck it was. Yeah, that was always that my roommates would be up there. It was fun. It was a fun time. I was getting all <laughs> fucked up all the time, but it was fun. Uh, some of the jokes that you told there were fucking I incredible, dude. Uh, I don't know. You Thank you. Yeah, and people don't really see a lot of those episodes. They're not as popular. It's a lot more popular now. Yeah, and, and, and some of them didn't make any sense because I guess, I mean, you were a, a bit <laughs> But a lot of them were fucking incredible, dude. I, I don't know. He, uh, well, I always like you, your Diego. job writing. Yeah, no, Can thank I tell you. you a joke? Yeah, let's hear one. Uh, fuck. I was watching this, uh, <laughs> penguin documentary in, uh, fucking discovery channel. Yeah. And all of a sudden a deep go boys guy goes like the penguins pussy. <laughs> it's going to be the tightest in the animal world. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, damn, what kind of naughty professor discovered that? Yeah. <laughs> Who's having sex with those penguins? How do they, and then how do they know to compare it to the other vaginas in the animal world? Yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, uh, how do, I mean, if they're doing it with penguins, they're doing it with other shit. 100%. So. I mean, what else would they be doing it with? Like hippopotamuses, other water dolphins there's a guy scuba diving uh trying to finger fuck a fish dude <laughs> <laughs> and that would be fun on stage because that sounds fun finger yes. fuck a fish yeah that's it just yeah, yeah, sounds yeah. fun nutty professor too yeah, yeah nutty I, professor I, I, finger fuck it that's a crazy that's a quite the visual and then when you're <laughs> saying it with that fun deep voice <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. always people tell me that i have a uh, I don't know. I'm just huge, dude. My fucking thorax generates like very uh, deep sounding shit. <laughs> yeah. I've heard bigger people have the bigger thoraxes mm -hmm. where the, <laughs> the voice is, yeah, deeper, kind of like a baritone or something, but it's beautiful, Diego. Gorgeous. Man, it's so fucking crazy to talk to you. <laughs> I, I wish I could. I wish I had a fucking visa to go to Kill Tony to sign up, but uh, how hard is it to get on it? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I don't know how many people sign up. What? Like a yeah, couple hundred, maybe. Yeah, maybe a couple hundred. So what? Yeah, I don't know. I, so statistically, whatever that is, I mean, I think it's.
But who knows, Diego? You get your visa, I'll I'll get your ass in there. I'm kidding. No, I wouldn't have the power <laughs> at all to do that. No, I so I can't. Yeah. Uh, but you yeah, be good. Huh? Sorry, you signed up a few months before you got your chance, right? Yeah, I think for like nine months or something. There was some uh, lady who was running an open mic in Hollywood who was in porn, and she did some <laughs> open mic in Hollywood, and I live kind of close by it, so I just started going up over there, and then I was like, ah, oh, that's kind of weird. <laughs> so then I started going back up there. Uh, yeah, it took a while, uh, but it's been fun. You just got to keep trying. Yeah, if you're going to sign up, just keep trying. For sure. Get up eventually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I look like a fucking lumberjack anyway, so I don't, even if I go illegally, I'll just say my name is uh, Brian or something. Yeah, Matthew. <laughs> Matthew could be a good one. Yeah, yeah so your name is Brian, though. <laughs> we'll let you right through the border. Yes. Be... <laughs> yeah, just, All right, yeah. I guess yeah. it's Brian. <laughs> I got lost down here. I'm going back to visit my family in Utah. My name's Brian. Can I please? Yeah, I, have a, I had my bachelor's party down in Tijuana. <laughs> yes, so you need to create a story. <laughs> you need a backstory. You need to create a backstory before you do it. Yeah, you'll be able to do it. Maybe Brian from Utah, maybe mm -hmm. New Mexico, I maybe, play, I don't I know, maybe Tennessee. I... Uh, what? Sorry? Maybe, I was just naming off different states you could say you were from. <laughs> you have what, what 50 options. From? What state? Montana. Yeah, Montana could be a good one. It might look like you are actually from Montana, so Montana could be a good one. I look white as shit, man. What the <laughs> hell? Yeah, you get enough vitamin D out there? You out in the sun a decent amount? You look a little sick. <laughs> Would you be in the sun with fucking 150? <laughs> no. Yeah, 150 is hot as hell. No, there's Much no way. Hot. No way. Yeah, yeah. Well, you got me worried with the... With the uh, with the skin cancer thing? Yeah, be careful. I think I have more on my face. I have to go back to the dermatologist. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Yeah, so be yet. careful. Where, yeah, I'm not done yet, done unfortunately. Yet, Just uh, yeah, wear sunscreen, Diego. <laughs> I, I, I've i never wore that shit, so now I'm worried. <laughs> well, good luck. Hopefully you were wearing a big shirt or something when you go out to the beach. Did you at least have a shirt on? Uh, No. When I was a kid, <laughs> we used to go to the same beach always. It was piping hot. <laughs> and I was just out the there. The water was naked. really hot. <laughs> oh shit! It's it's incredible out here. You you should have you come to Mexico? No, I'd love to. I only recently got a passport. Uh, but yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm sure it'd be fun. I'd have yeah, to be careful. I read a lot of the cartel stuff because I'm a crazy person. <laughs> but I guess the chances of that happening are probably low if you're in like Mexico City. I don't know. Yeah. If you go to tourist places, there's really not much of that going on. It, it, I mean, like places like Cancun are run by the cartels, and they know if they kill uh, a gringo, they have. I mean, hold on, what you just call us? Yeah, <laughs> what you just say, Grant? He's done. Okay, Grant, get him off. Grant, he's done. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right, uh, well, yeah, maybe sometime. Slur? Huh? No. Is that a racist? Slur? No. We're just busting your chops. Yeah, we're kidding around, Diego. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. No, uh, we're totally kidding. Well, Diego, very nice to talk to you. Very nice to talk <laughs> to you, man. Uh, talk to you, I mean, hopefully soon. Thank you. Bye. Cool. For Bye. Sure. Good to see you. Bye. Sweet Diego. I didn't know Good there night. were the college football teams in Mexico. I didn't know that either. That, yeah, that was shocking. In the water, so hot. I know. Agua f caliente. Caliente. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Cool. Well, that was fun. Fun talking with the people. It was fun. Allison, Mo, the whole gang, Diego, other. Ocean. Ocean. He was walking around a bunch. Yeah, he was pacing. He had some. Grant. 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 He had a fire going on inside him that we could only hope to yeah. one day understand. Pretty fierce. Pretty fierce. All right. Well, very nice uh, talking with everybody. And that's another one. Another one. <laughs> Pretty successful. Good people today. Everybody's very complimentary. Very nice. Yeah, we love to. Thanks for joining us for this week's episode of The William Montgomery Show. Send your questions, artwork, and manifestos to The William Montgomery Show at gmail.com. 
Leave William a voicemail at 737-471-1098. Never miss an episode of The William Montgomery Show by subscribing to The William Montgomery Show channel on YouTube and anywhere podcasts are sold. Check out William online at william.f.montgomery1 on Instagram. For more William Montgomery, check out Kill Tony on YouTube and see him live at the Vulcan Gas Company in Austin, Texas every Monday night. For more of me, Brett Erickson, check out Issues with Andy on Patreon. Find me on Twitter and Instagram at IBrettMyPants. This episode of The William Montgomery Show was recorded at Permanent Record Studios right here in the heart of Austin. The William Montgomery Show is produced by William Montgomery and Brett Erickson. The William Montgomery Show is a Fanny Co. production. Thanks for joining us. See you next time. Shh. Who the fuck said that? I'm trying to have fun tonight.